，欢迎收看美国之音制作的《美国专讯》，我是陆毅。美国流行歌手米雪布兰奇在二零零一年被唱片公司看中，推出第一张专辑，其中一首歌曲更是挤入头二十名排行榜。到二零零五年，他开始转向乡村音乐创作。六年后的今天，他又开始从事其他歌曲创作。最近，他接受记者拉里·伦敦的采访，畅谈心路历程。布兰奇与桑塔拿灌录的《爱情游戏》获得格莱美奖。他本人灌录的三首其他单曲进入流行曲头二十首排行榜，他的名气已经无可置疑。但是名气并不影响他重返乡村音乐。与杰西卡·哈伯合作，由女子救援组乐队的伴奏。现在布兰奇已经重拾流行乐，但是他在他的新 CD《西岸时间》当中，仍然歌唱他在乡村的经历。I had a country band called The Wreckers for a while, and I moved to Nashville and. It's it's sort of a a song about my time spent there and how I always felt kind of a little bit different because um you know everyone had their southern upbringing there and um and I was raised on the west coast and had a had an upbringing of a little bit of country music but a lot of rock and roll. Now, don't just walk. 布兰奇推出两个专辑的流行曲之后，已经成为明星。但是他为什么还热衷于乡村音乐呢？ My, oh my, I grew up listening to older country music,、um, Patsy Cline and Johnny Cash, and um and and those greats.、Um, and I just always loved the storytelling aspect and、um, where the lyrics came from. And so that was. That was something that I was really drawn to, and、um, it just felt too special to to turn our back on. From that day on, Blanche's life and her music direction has changed. The writing has changed a lot because、um, my last pop album was released almost eight years ago. And I'm I'm married and a mother now, and I think a lot has changed. I've seen a lot of the world, so my perspective lyrically has changed a lot. I think the songwriting is classic Michelle, but、um, there's some definitely new modern sounds. Blanche's life is a big change. It happened in her 15th birthday. She received a phone call from her best friend, telling her to hurry up and meet a record label executive, and telling her that she's still in college. She called me. She said, "You have to get down here and bring a tape or meet this guy because、um, he's going to be leaving soon." I said, "Well, I can't get down there." She said, "Do you have just walk, ride your bike, anything?" My neighbors had left their golf cart out in the driveway with the key in it, <laughs> and so I took the golf cart and I went down and I was waiting as this guy was leaving. I was like, "Excuse me, Mister, will you listen to my tape?" And he was just horrified. But he, on the long drive home back from Arizona to LA, he put it in the car and he ended up calling me. Cause you're heavy. 布兰奇很希望听到他的乐迷如何评价他的 CD。他希望与世界听众多多交流。记者拉里·伦敦，华盛顿报道。心脏病虽然是世界疾病第一杀手，但却可以预防。有研究显示，女性患心脏病的风险大于男性，部分原因是女性心脏病更难被诊断。记者皮尔逊的报道。男性心脏病发作往往是因为血管堵塞。用 X 光做血管摄影，通常可以发现血管是否有阻塞。血管摄影需要将一条细管深入病人的动脉。但是血管摄影并不总能发现女性血管的问题，所以女性心脏病发作的风险更大。世界卫生组织报告说，世界每年死于心脏病的女性多达一千八百万人，而且并不限于年纪较大的女性。卡利生第一个孩子的时候就心脏病发作，而且很严重。My God, it was thirty-one years old. Thirty-one year olds don't have heart attacks. 卡利现在对女性宣传预防的必要性，艾琳听了之后马上采取行动。Heart disease was the number one killer of women. 艾琳发起姊妹相助组织，专门向妇女宣传如何预防心脏病
。他鼓励妇女了解自己的血压、胆固醇水平以及其他风险因素。The goal is really prevention,、uh, having people understand、uh, their risk that that they should really try to get screened, know their numbers, and then do something about it. 艾琳与波士顿布莱根妇女医院心脏专科医生合作，富迪博士就是其中之一。The good news is we know that 90% of heart disease is preventable by reducing risk. 要减少风险，就要做到坚持不抽烟，要避免糖尿病或控制糖尿病，保持健康的体重，饮食要健康，每天运动三十分钟，控制或减少压力。记者皮尔逊报道。谢谢收看美国之音制作的《美国专讯》，我是陆毅，我们下星期再见。